<clears throat> I'm just speeding it up a bit. So it's going at two times speed, speed it up, because then it ain't a long video. Um, the T28, I can't say I'm a fan of it. Um, it, it doesn't, it doesn't really do much for me. Um, so this is the master battle. Obviously, it's just doubled up. So you know, um, my th first point of call is to go towards well, the fire area and just stay there for a bit and see see where the enemy is and. And, and, and really try to act as a as a scout around this area. Um, it kind of worked a bit. Um, I'm in a platoon with my cousin, so we were playing as a team. Um, <coughs> he's pretty new to the game, so he's only got two. Like, he's played like 200 games now, so he's still getting used to playing the game and how and, and, and to, to position your tank and things like that. So, but yeah, we we didn't have a bad game. Um, I started off really, I, I didn't think I was going to get far at all to be honest with you because the light tank started laying into me so I had to be careful there. Um, this tank hasn't got no armor at all. Um, I think one of the key things that, yeah, I, I really am confused with this tank. This tank just, for me, it just, nah, it's not my type of tank but as, as I said before, at the moment I'm just trying to act like a bit like a scout to try and show them but obviously I don't want to go too far too far ahead because I know this tank the armor on it is really bad um, so you've got to take it very careful and there's my first kill um, this was a hell of a shot I, I can't believe the KV-1 just let me do this um, I, I, I was just having a hell of a time on this. Um, bit good I didn't take him out there, but you know, <clears throat> I was lucky there an artillery just hit me, but just missed me, luckily. Um, here I didn't think I was going to be able to pen him because obviously it's KV1. I'm only a teeth, but I was aiming at his lower weak spot, which obviously allowed me to pen him. And that's a bit of a panicky move there, uh, so we're getting in my way because obviously I was being shot. Um, I knew I had to get round and try and take these artillery out or that was one of the ones that I wanted to take out. This is where um, I get a bit of a few bad rolls here. Um, this has left me in a very, very dodgy position. Um, <clears throat> I knew I had to try and take that tank killer out because he was a danger that was trapping us on both sides. So here I, I just went for it. I was going to go across the bridge, but then I thought, well, no, let's go the other way because he might not be expecting me this way. Um, so I was hoping to take him by surprise, but I think I did take him by surprise because his gun was pointing at me, but he just didn't bother firing. And luckily I was waiting and I was zoomed in, just waiting for him to come forward. Um, yeah, uh, overall, I thought, well, I'm low health, you know, a one hit kill. I thought, well, I'm not going to go and put myself in danger and lose the battle. Um, so, all I'd done was just kept a bit vulnerable and just waited for them to come to me because, at the end of the day, if they wanted to win, they should come to attack. Um, I was a one hit hit. You know, I, I, they could have hit me once and I would have been a comic. But they didn't. Um, the artillery was trying his best. Both the artillery was trying his best, but um, I'm very happy with that. Um, I didn't think I would ever be able to master this tank because it is a very difficult tank uh, to play. But I did four kills, plenty of damage. Um, as you can see, 1,200 damage in total. So yeah, overall I was happy with that. Um, thanks for watching. Um, until next, until my ma next master badge. <coughs>